One person is hospitalized tonight after a shooting at a Middleton car dealership, and police say they now have a suspect in custody. They have only identified the suspect as an adult woman. The victim, who is a man, was taken to the hospital, but we have not received an update on his condition. McKenna Alexander has the latest on today's shooting. McKenna? Yeah, tonight Middleton police are continuing their investigation into what started today's shooting at MSI Auto Sales as nearby residents come to terms with the shock that this happened in their neighborhood. I only hear ambulances go back and forth, but I'm not seeing a lot. Of, there's not a whole lot of police presence, so pretty wild to see something like this happen. Sam Krasnowski is one of many Middleton residents surprised to learn of Monday afternoon shooting in the 3000 block of Parmenter Street. I was working and all of a sudden around, I don't know, might have been around 1.30 and a bunch of cops came kind of pulling up and just kind of been watching ever since and knew it was a big deal once they started putting the um, caution tape around. At 1.36 p.m. today, the Middleton Police Department responded to a report of gunfire and a victim down in the parking lot of the MSI Auto here on Parmenter Streets. Upon arrival, the officers located a victim and that victim was transported to a local hospital. Over a dozen squad cars could be seen in the area as police tape blocked off the dealership and its parking lot where shattered glass could be seen. Somewhere on the property okay. here, we we're still trying to sort that out, whether it's inside the business or in the parking lot. A Middleton Cross Plains Area School District spokesperson says nearby schools were also put into a secure hold around 2.30, but that was lifted shortly after around 2.45. Police stress there is no ongoing threat to the public, as they believe this incident was tied to an argument within the business and its employees. It was not random. This was a dispute at this business, some altercation that happened here, some gunfire, um, but again, no, no threat to the greater community. We believe it's a dispute related to this business. As of 3.40 Monday afternoon, a female adult was arrested in connection with the shooting, while the condition of the victim, a male adult, is still unknown. Police are still investigating today's shooting, so be sure to stick with us on air and online as we continue to learn more.